YouTube family don't mind my look um, I'm a bit rough right now um, this video is going to be about my Oshun altar today is Mother's Day and I thought like what better way to like refresh my altar than on Mother's Day um, plus my statue is coming today of the beautiful Orisha so I just thought that it was gonna be it would be like really good to invite her in so I am going to um post about what I'm gonna add on my altar what I'm gonna put on there I just um I kind of already cleansed the top part of the altar I cleansed it with um Florida water and sun water and I'm cleaning each thing that I'm placing on there as well so I'm just gonna go through and do like a little step by step on what is on my altar for you guys so stay tuned okay so some things that I'm adding to my Oshun altar is this honey bee pot which I filled with honey and the beautiful goddess lets me know when it's time to empty it out I got her this mirror that has butterflies on it she loves butterflies I made her this sunflower arrangement um, along with some jewelry she loves peacocks and I actually got this peacock like years ago there are some gems missing from it but you know I cleansed them I blessed them these are just some jewelries that I have for her um, and I got her a apple cinnamon fragrance oil for when I do my rituals and stuff because she loves cinnamon I got her you know of course honey this is a little bell that I have um, for whenever I wish to connect with her she is the river goddess so I already had had this and she made it very known that she would like this on the altar um, I got her I actually didn't get this specifically for her I was just drawn to it at the Dollar Tree it's a cinnamon broomstick and you know I, um, Oshun is the queen of the witches so she loves this and it actually still smells like it smells like big big red gum um, and then I have this pyrite crystal that I put on her altar and along with my money tree because I go to her whenever I just recently started going to her for whenever I want um, clients and things like that um, so I keep this on her altar. along with this hand because like I said she's all about divination and she loves gold so this is also on her altar so this is the top shelf of her altar that I'm getting together right now so yeah, stay tuned. I'm actually in the process of making her a her very own bowl where I'm going to place her candle in. And I'm going to place it in the center along with her statue up here for when she arrives. And I'm going to cleanse the space with a goddess incense once I'm finished. And just to bless the space for her arrival. And of course, I purchased um, a Oshun candle at my local Botanica. And yeah, so I'm excited to start her altar today. I cannot wait for her statue to arrive. And I just think that it would be really good to, you know, honor her and start her altar fresh and clean on Mother's Day. Um, yeah, so I think she would really appreciate me doing this for her. And I will show you guys the finished product when I'm finished. And there actually were a couple things that I forgot to add. So I got this um, sunflower candle holder at Goodwill. And I wanted to let you guys know that a lot of the things that I have on the altar, this is kind of the finished version aside from the statue. Um, but these, I got at Dollar Tree. I got this at the Dollar Tree. I got the moss at the Dollar Tree. I got this bell at Goodwill. I got the mirror for, I think, like $12 on Amazon. I got the honeybee jar on Amazon. Um, at the time, I was at Dollar Tree, and I had, like, a whole bunch of stuff for Oshun in my cart. And I know normally she likes, um, she likes organic honey, but she said that this was fine for now. So I got her this at the Dollar Tree. I got this clear bowl at Walmart. I got this sunflowers at Walmart and I kind of just like, she said that she wanted like gold in it and I put five cinnamon sticks in there because her number is five. I put her jewelry in there. I cleansed the candle. I got again this candle at my local Botanica. 
I believe I got this. I believe I got this hand at Big Lots for like ten dollars. Um, and yeah, the holy water I got on Amazon. The Florida water I got at Botanica. I got my money tree at Home Depot. And then these were also some things that I forgot to mention, which is my Roshun oil, um, a jinx remover oil, and a reconciliation and strength and hold oil for my relationship since I work with her regarding my relationship. And yeah, so this is the finished product so far. Um, and I cannot wait for her statue to come because she is about to shut shit down. I'm going to try to figure out where she's going to go because I know she's going to want to be front and center and in the middle. So we're going to figure that out. And then I will take a picture of the finished product once the beautiful goddess arrives. Bye. So you guys, here is the finished product. Um, I guess I'll flip it this way for y'all. And I did change a little bit of things. Um, I've got my Oshun statue and my feathers at the same time. I anointed the beautiful goddess with her Oshun oil and I lit her candle. So yes, this is the finished product of the beautiful goddess's Oshun's altar. If you guys have any questions about the goddess, just leave a comment down below. And yeah. Stay tuned for more videos, guys. Like, share, and subscribe. Bye.